And now some news from space. An asteroid zoomed past the Earth this morning. What's an asteroid? These are rock-like structures that go around the sun. They're also called minor planets. Asteroids, in most cases, are harmless. Those are the cases when they're not heading straight to the Earth. But this one was dangerously close. It went past the Earth nine times faster than a rifle bullet, nine times faster, and it was just 240,000 kilometers away from Earth. I know it sounds like a lot, but in astronomical terms, this distance is too close for comfort. Space agencies are keeping a close eye. Is the world at threat? Our next report tells you. A new asteroid has grabbed the attention of space watchers. It's called the 2023 EY. This rock-like structure cruised past the Earth earlier today. It was a close shave. How close, you ask? Some 240,000 kilometers. That's 10 times a round trip from New Delhi to Washington. It may seem like a lot of distance, but for astronomers, it was dangerously close. The asteroid was closer to the Earth than the Moon. The Moon is roughly 385,000 kilometers away from Earth. So technically, the 2023 EY asteroid flew between the Moon and the Earth. The proximity was concerning, and so was the speed. The asteroid whizzed past at a blazing speed, some 18,000 miles per hour. You know how fast that is? It's nine times faster than a rifle bullet. A third worrying factor was its size. This was a large rock. It's been described as house-sized, about 16 meters in diameter, roughly the same size as the Chelyabinsk meteor. What's that? It was part of the asteroid that entered the Earth in 2013. It exploded near Siberia. It broke windows in some Russian cities and injured at least 1,500 people on Earth. Thankfully, the 2023 EY isn't expected to enter the Earth. But astronomers have classified it as an Apollo NEO, or Near Earth Object. It's named after the 1862 Apollo asteroid. And these NEOs, or Near Earth Objects, are those that have their paths crossing the Earth. You'd be surprised at how many objects are near the Earth. As of February 2023, there are more than 17,000 such asteroids. They may not be visible to the naked eye, but they're captured in telescopes. Such long-range telescopes have been deployed in various parts of the world. Their job is to keep an eye on objects flying close to the Earth and raise an alarm if they get too close. Take the example of the 2023 DW asteroid. It was spotted a few weeks back. And the risks from it, albeit small, have been predicted for as far as 2046. How do you minimize this risk? How do you ensure that it doesn't hit the Earth and cause damage? The key is detection in advance, years in advance. And deploying spacecraft that can deflect asteroids. It's called DART, or the Double Asteroid Redirection Test. DART spacecraft is going to impact an asteroid and try to change its orbit. This is the first test of planetary defense. Yeah, so the spacecraft launched last November and it's been traveling out. It's a little about 6.7 million miles away. And up until now, it's been controlled a lot by the mission control there. They can adjust it. When it gets close to the asteroid, it'll switch to a, an automated navigation where it'll guide itself into the asteroid and impact the asteroid. So while the trajectory of the 2023 EY asteroid makes for a gripping sight, Astronomers are working to ensure the Earth doesn't suffer any external damage. You could call them the real-life guardians of the galaxy.